Hi, and welcome. I well, thank you for stopping by. So today I want to talk to you about um, I finally beat uh, Resident Evil 4 on uh, Perfection Mode on uh, Nintendo Switch. Okay? Okay? It took me like um, two weeks to beat it. Resident Evil 4 on Nintendo Switch. Okay? Uh, I'm a I'm a big Resident Evil 4 fan. I beat the Resident Evil 4 remake one time. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, I grew up playing Resident Evil 4. Okay. On the uh, GameCube. Okay. Uh, okay. I uh, did back in the day. Yeah, I'm going to say back in the day, when I had, uh, the F-Plus 360, uh, I, I played, uh, um, Resident, Resident Evil 5, back in the day when, when, uh, I had the F-Plus 360 and kept taking it to, uh, Step 5, and had, uh, my, my F-Plus 360 had the Ring of Death, okay, um, Okay, but I don't have F-Plus 50 anymore, okay? But that was, that was like a memory, okay? Um, but, um, okay? So every once in a while, I would play Resident Evil 5. And I, 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 I am also a fan of Resident Evil 5. Okay? I am a, I am a fan of Resident Evil franchise, the, the video game, the movie. I think of Power Garbage. Okay? Uh, how can you have a, a, an awesome, uh, uh, video game franchise, one of the best video game franchise ever, and uh, the movie of Power Garbage. How can you not adapt it into an awesome movie? I don't know. Okay. Um, okay. Um, I think I beat uh, Resident Evil 5 one or two times. Like, I think I, I know I beat it one or two times on my FS360 back in the day, and then at least one or two times. Um, on a Nintendo Switch, okay, and a, and a Red Dead will fit, I play it halfway through, okay, um, okay, uh, but, uh, so, uh, yeah, it, it took me, like, like I said, two weeks to be Red Dead will, um, four on a Nintendo Switch, and, uh, I read somewhere that, um, uh, I think, like, an article said that, that you have to get, like, an x ray in order to get the hand cannon gun, and I'm like, if that, if that was true, then I probably got, like, an x ray I kept dying, like, a billion times, and also I followed the guy, um, video, a walkthrough, you know, walkthrough, a slap playthrough, uh, professional with no gaming, and I'm like, how he does that? Okay, um, and, um, okay, um, okay, and a Red Demon 4 was the first Red Demon game that I got introduced to the, uh, uh, franchise, okay, um, so, um, uh, yeah, okay, um, I always try to, like, uh, climb up the ladder and knife the uh, the dummy down the ladder so I can save my bullet, even try to knife the, uh, chainsaw guy, I still do it. Okay? Um, okay, um, now, um, um, before, before, uh, I started on, um, the professional mode, I'm like, I, I should, I should, uh, if I'm a big Red Game before fan, uh, I need to be on professional, okay? Uh, uh, nobody in my family, you know, my brother and stuff, never be on um, professional. Maybe I could do it. And, uh, before I, I started to do that, I had, I had the infinite rocket launcher and the infinite, you know, Chicago type fighter. And I was going to the game and I'm like, uh, this is too easy, <laughs> okay? Uh, okay? So, I raised my level and I'm like, you know what? 
I'm gonna be adamant, I'm gonna be strong, I'm fine, I'm go through the game, beat the game, I'm professional, I'm probably gonna be like forever. Uh and you know what? I did. I did that guy video. Um Okay, and 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 every time I I, I cut a uh, a um, a barrel, I go run back and save it. I probably save it like a billion times, a billion to billion times. I die like a billion times, but I did. Okay, um, okay. There was some, there was some part I thought I was gonna die like a million, a lot. I did it. I just went back and uh, um buy a rocket launcher and kill that. That a boss, that monster, and then at some point I died like a, 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 a million times. Okay, um, okay, um, okay, um, I beat like a, a lot on my uh, GameCube. Okay, and I still got I still got the save um, level on my GameCube uh, right here. Um, okay, I'm trying to get it out. Hey, that's my memory card for my GameCube, okay? Um, okay. Okay. And I still got my, uh, I still got my, uh, GameCube right here. Like, like 10 or 15 years ago, I went to, uh, I went to GameStop, and they had it, I think, I think like 20 30 dollars, and I bought it. Okay. Uh, I and I still have it. Okay. Um. To be honest, the first game I was ever introduced to on the um, Nintendo GameCube was uh, Christmas Day. That I think my dad bought me. Me and my brother was a black GameCube and Pikmin. Okay. So. I would say probably my three favorite GameCube game would be Pikmin, Red Evil 4, and uh, Super Smash Bros. Melee, okay? But I do remember that. Then on Christmas Day, uh, me and my brother got a black GameCube and uh, Pikmin, okay? So I was so happy when I found out they, they got a combo pack for Nintendo Switch. Uh, Pikmin 1 and 2, and then, then when I told my brother about it, he went out and got a Pikmin 1 and 2, the combo pack, for his Nintendo Switch, okay? Um, so, um, so, um, okay, um, I'm gonna go back, and I'm gonna go back and, uh, try to beat a Red Game with 5, Troopy Time, you know, the easy mode, the normal mode, in the veteran mode, and uh, I think veteran mode might be hard. I don't know if it is or not. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see uh, uh, what the infinite weapon that you can get in uh, Red Demon Five. Okay, um, and then after I unlock the infinite weapon in Red Demon um, Five, then I'll turn around and beat it with the infinite weapon in Red Demon Five. And then I'll go play uh, Red Demon 6 and do the same thing with that. Okay? Trying to unlock the infinite weapon in Red Demon um, 6. Okay? So there, there was one point, like, I don't know, uh, like 57 years ago, or maybe 10 years ago, I beat like halfway through it. Okay? Um, and, okay? Um, I did. Uh, one point, probably halfway through, uh, Red Evil. Uh, people, I think, uh, I read that this is like the remake of the original one, probably halfway through. To me, this is the hardest one. Okay? For like saving and stuff, because you got, okay, like, Red Evil 4, you can save it like a million times. Whereas, in this one, uh, you, you have to save, only if you have ink ribbon. I'm like, what? So you gotta be careful how you stay. Yeah, okay. So I already played Red and Evil, um, Red and Evil, um, like halfway through one time. And then I, I think I like that stuff when I was saving. So 
I was frustrated, do I just turn it off? I went to play Red Team 4 and 5. Okay, to be honest. I never played Red Team 2 and 3. Okay. Uh, I think one time I played the one for the 3DS when I was in like, like junior high or something. My dad bought it for me and we gave him money. He bought it for us. Okay. I think, I think we're like, where the, uh, Red Team were mercenaries or something. Okay. But I don't think I still have that no more. Uh, okay. But, um, I would be happy, uh, if they came out with the Red and Evil 1, 2, and 3, or kind of like, kind of like the triple pack, but it'd be 1, 2, and 3 for the Nintendo Switch. I'll be happy if they did that, and I'll go buy it and play it, okay? To be honest, um, even though I'm a Red and Evil fan of the game, I never play all of them, okay? Because there's too many of them, and, uh, like I said, I just finished being like two weeks ago. Um, it took me two weeks ago, two weeks to beat, uh, Red Evil 4 on, um, the Kindle Switch on professional mode. Hard mode, when you're on card, okay? And then it unlocked me the, uh, the hand cannon. And I thought that you had to get, like, an X-ranking or something. And I said, no, uh, I got, like, an X-ranking and I got, like, a certain time, okay? Um, okay? Um, so, um, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, okay, uh, so, um, so, in conclusion, I don't want to try to be rambling on or anything, in conclusion, um, uh, I'm so happy that I got the hand cannon to, like, you know, uh, with the hand cannon, uh, patrol, take, it takes two shots with the hand cannon to kill him, the blind guy, um, uh, Take one shot with the hand cannon. Okay, so I'm halfway through the game now with with uh, the hand cannon. Okay, um, okay, um, I'm gonna go play Red Dead Five and try to unlock all the infinite uh, weapons and also uh, try to be a professional. Okay, and but if I get an infinite weapon, I'll probably have to have like a million dollars. So I'll probably need to be on, on easy mode, normal, and, and then hard, and then see if, uh, uh, I think it's a veteran. So I, I don't, I don't know if veteran is a hard mode or not, professional mode, we're gonna call it. So, so I gotta be a couple more times, save up like a million dollars, so I can buy infinite weapons. Okay? Um, okay? And then, I'll do that for Red Evil Dead, and see if Red, see if Red Evil Dead have infinite weapons, Hard mode, and I'll do all that too. You know, be it on professional mode, and also, uh, unlock all the infinite weapons. Okay? Um, okay? But, out of all the Red Evil games that I played, 4 and 5 is probably my favorite. I played halfway through Red Evil 1. To me, Red Evil 1 is probably the scariest, because slow mode, the zombies go slow, and take, take a few seconds for the door to open. Red Demon 1, Red Demon 1 probably the scariest for me. Uh, okay. The scariest creature in Red Demon 4 is the great creature, what's it called, the Regeneration. Okay, they bite your neck. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, and like I said, uh, I'll be all, ha all four or happy if they came out with another Red Demon pack. It came with Red Demon 1, 2, and 3 from the Channel Trip. If they do have it, let me know where I can buy it, and let me know a link or a picture of it so I can buy it. Okay? So, yeah. So, in conclusion, uh, took me two weeks to beat Red Evil on professional mode, and after I beat it on professional mode, I unlocked the hand cannon. I'm so happy. Thank y'all for watching, and um, are you a Red Evil fan? Uh, I would say just play the Red Evil game. Four, five, uh, or any other game, and don't play, don't watch the movie. The movie, are no good. Okay, movie or power or garbage. Okay, you have the movie, and then no Leon, no Craig, no Wester. I'm like, what? Yeah, so that's it. Thank you. Ha have a good day, and thank you and God bless.